Hey everyone, in today's iMovie video, I'm going to show you how to add text inside of iMovie to any project that you've edited on iMovie. So if you don't know how to add text or you don't feel like you're getting the most benefit out of adding text, I'm going to cover everything that you could do with text inside of iMovie. And this is part of my iMovie course that just got released this week where I cover everything iMovie has to offer from 15 years of editing experience and literally every single feature inside of iMovie I covered it and I specially designed it for beginners in mind so I could walk you through the step-by-step -step process of editing in a very linear way that is easy to understand if you've never edited before. So I'll put a link to that in the description below. Right now I'm running a sale since it's the week of the launch. Right now, let's figure out how to add text inside of iMovie. I'm just here on the project panel of iMovie. I'm gonna go ahead and double click to open one of my projects. If you don't have one, just press the plus sign to create a new one. And to add titles or text to anything inside of an iMovie project, just come up here and next to audio, you'll find titles. And if you scroll down, these are all the different text styles that you could add. So I wanna show you some of the popular ones here and how to customize each one. Now there are three different ways in iMovie to add text to your project. One is you could add text on top of existing footage. So what you see here on top of this drone shot. The second option is just putting text on a black background like you see here. So there's no video file here at all. So it's just text on top of a blank background or there's an option for putting text on top of backgrounds that iMovie gives you. And that's over here next to title, there's another menu called backgrounds and you could select any of these backgrounds, including these solid colors here, and then put your text on top of those. So three different things. The most common one is putting text on top of video. So let me show you that first. Let's go back to titles. And as you see all these different titles, if you just take your mouse here and just scrub over them here, just from left to right, you could see the text animation. Now, there is nothing you could do with how these texts are animated or where they are on your screen. So pick one that best represents what you're looking to do. If you're looking for a title, for example, this is great, right in the center of the screen. You can change the font and the color, and I'll show you that too. Or for example, if you wanna give someone a title, for example, that could be one of these. But it's unfortunate that you can't move the text anywhere you want. In more advanced editing software, you can do that. But here, if you want title screen, for example, for credits, you'll just choose something like this. So let's start with adding one on video. So I already added a video down here from my media tab. So now I'm gonna choose one of these titles up here. And I think I'm going to choose this one right here. So I'll go ahead and grab it and put it right on top of my video here. Now I could extend it so it lines up with my entire video length with this clip. Make sure it starts in the very beginning and ends at the end. So now I could see how the text animates in. Pretty nice text here. I could always change the font, but I could either press play up here to see it or I could just grab this and move it left and right, see how that text comes in. So this is text on top of video. Let me show you how to edit this text double click it and it shows up over here and it selects this T, which gives you options to change your font, the size of the font, the alignment of the text, and then you got a little bit of a styling option with bold underline and outline. Now, the first thing I wanna do here before I change any of the style is I wanna type my text. So I'll call this the beach, for example, and let's go ahead and change the font. So you could go down here, and choose one of these for your font. I like these bold ones for title, especially on top of video. So I'll choose this one here, nice and bold. I'll capitalize the T here. And you could select this and change the font size. So I could go all the way to 175, for example, and press enter. So you could type in the font right here, the size. You could align it left, right, or center. So I'll leave this center. You can make it bold if you want. You can make it italic or you could give it this outline here if it's hard to read. So that's one way to make it stand out. I'll leave it as is. And here's the color. If you select the square here, it lets you pick just about any color or use this eye picker here, select this, 
to choose any color you see on your screen. So I could choose this color, for example. In this case, the white was fine. So I'll go back to the center and slide this all the way to go back to white. And I'll press X. So that's how you change the style of any text title in iMovie. Let me show you how to put one of these texts on top of a background. So let's go to the background tab next to the title tab. You have all these different backgrounds to choose from. So let's go ahead and grab one of these and bring it down here. And now if I go back to the title tab, I could grab one of these titles. I'll choose this one here and put it right on top. And just like that, if I press play in the beginning here, I could see how that title comes in. So as usual, I could double click it, change what the text says, change all the styling here. And you also have this reset option. If you make changes you don't like, if you just press that, it'll bring you back to what the text used to be without any of the font changes or styling changes that you apply to it. And finally, the last way you could use font is you could just drag fonts and bring them down here and they just sit on a black background. That means they're not on top of a video and they're not top of a background that you could find in iMovie. And here again, if you double click it, you could change it and you could have all the same options here. And it's that simple to add text inside of iMovie. Thanks so much for watching this video. Again, make sure you check out all the resources in the description below this video if you want more resources on iMovie. And I hope to catch you next time. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again.